How to create a sales order in Business Central. In this video, I'll show you how to create a sales order in Business Central. From the main menu, I'm going to select new sales order in the actions area right here. I'm going to click right here and it'll go directly to creating a new sales order. Here I can select the customer number directly and that will fill in the header information on my sales order. So let's go here and let's select the first one. And let's go down to lines. I can select between type items right here, resource, fixed assets, etc. So if I click here, you'll see there's resource, fixed address, uh, assets, a couple more. Uh, we're going to go with item. And in this case, I'll create an item number that we just created for our customer. So let's go here. And we'll pick this one. And I will select 25 pieces of that one. So in quantity, we'll put in 25. So here I'm going to select resource because I want to add some training um, and he would like to buy training for demonstrating in his research. So the trainer will be Linda and We'll go for two hours. And here, I'm going to select GL account because I will charge the customer for some transportation as well. Um, go with cash and Now, if we want to calculate the invoice discount, I'll have to go to actions. Then I'll have to go to functions and calculate invoice discount. Click yes here. And if the customer is set up with some labels for invoice discount, it will be calculated automatically. I would also add some more information on the header. For instance, a work description that we will await confirmation. Um, after this, I can proceed and either send an email or print the confirmation to PDF. So in this case, I'll print the confirmation to PDF. I can see both the invoice discount and all the lines, et cetera. And of course the GL account number is hidden. And in this case, the order confirmation is in English because the customer has an English language code. 